get psyched for more uninvited. Now, it turns out I have forgotten to do so many different things. And uh, I, there's so many different rooms I haven't been in yet. There's so, my, so much exploration that needs to be done. Let's find out more about this spooky, spooky mansion, how about? So, as you can see, look at all these rooms! Look at all these rooms. So let's just start with the, uh, I guess the top left? Seems like a good idea. Oh, this, okay. It seems to be an ordinary bedroom with uh, very chilling music, and it turns out I feel weak, and the pressure is beginning to bear down on me. Alright, so in here we have a book. I'm assuming I can read this book? Open, oh, it's a diary. This diary reads, My star is gone, but not lost. Uh, oh, oh okay. Master's servant will pay for his betrayal. So, the master, Master Crowley's servant took a star? The vehicle of my power has not yet served its purpose? Uh, oh. When it sets me free, I will have a chance to realize my unlimited potential. The forces of the techno te technological society will be unprepared for the likes of me. I will not be denied. My victory is inevitable. I'm assuming that this is uh, Mr. Dracon's diary. Uh, Mr. Draken? Mr. I like Dracon because it rhymes with pecan. And I like pecan pie. Or is it pronounced pecan? I don't know. You could go either way. I'm going to take this diary. Why not? Uh, we got some other stuff. We got... Is this a candle? Is that a candle? Ah, yes. I'll take a candle. I think that's actually very useful. Candle! Alright. Uh, we have a mirror. Oh, uh, I don't know why I'm trying to open the mirror. Let's examine the mirror. It's a large mirror. Okay. Um, you know what's kind of cool about the mirrors? You can actually punch them. And they break. <laughs> You can't do anything with the pieces, but you can break the mirrors. Alright, what's this? Abstract painting has no signature upon it. Alright. What's this? You see nothing unusual. It's a small reading lamp. Oh, that's super important. Let's go in here. I'm assuming this is a bathroom. I'm assuming this is a bathroom. I was right! A bathroom with no toilet. Hmm, that's... You notice? <laughs> yeah, see, there's there's no toilet. What's the purpose of that? Why why would you have a bathtub and no toilet? Wait, you're just gonna waffle st stomp everything down this thing? That's disgusting. This is disgusting. Dracon, you're disgusting. All right, let's see. We got a towel. It's a soft towel. We got a laundry hamper. Maybe this is the toilet? No, it's it's not a hamper and a toilet. Oh, let's see. Towel two. I don't think I want this. It's in the. It's a towel. It smells pretty bad. You also know that's stained with blood. Uh, let's see, I don't want that. Uh, let's see what else we got. We got a bar of soap. Bar of soap emits no odor. Okay, and we got another mirror, which I guess I could punch. This light fixture seems to have been shaped to be gripped. Ah, oh, so maybe I can open this? Can I open this? It's too high. <laughs> yes, it is. It's too high. Alright, so I guess I can't do anything with that. Alright, let's just leave the bathroom for now. I don't need any of those items. I don't I don't think I need a dirty towel. I mean, I guess I could be wrong. Do do I need a dirty towel? No, I don't. Alright, what's over in the bottom left room? Oh look, it's another it's a it's a master bedroom. Alright, so Master Crowley probably hung out in here a lot. See a wheelchair? Seems like something Master Crowley would use, because he's an old decrepit man. Got some paintings. Um uh, hmm a nice pretty woman okay and eyes of a uh, okay dark and sunken D seems interesting another beautiful woman Terry Marsh Duchess of Trent I've never been to Trent sounds sounds lovely this time of year uh, let's see we got some candles do I want to take the candles I already have a candle I think I only need one I will take the I'll take his diary I think that's his diary it's a book of some sort Let's learn more about this mansion. We, we realize that Draken is trying to become all powerful so he can, you know, take out society because it's oppressive, I guess. Too much technology doesn't like that shit. What about, uh, what about Crowley? What does he got to say? 
I have lost control of my student. My star student. Fancies himself as a master. Though his power is strong, his spirit is weak. He is easily corrupted by the dark spirits of greed and power? My servant, more aware than I, sealed his star in my hingeless box. Okay, they're locked away. You know that one room with the painting that apparently slides if you do something? I'm betting that was the well, that was the master's or the servant's quarters. It's probably behind that painting, this star. What's the star used for? I don't even know. I've hidden the key. A chair knows where. I think I already have the key for that. That's key one. So that's gonna open up that cabinet right there. So where's my where's my key? Did I not get the key yet? I thought I picked up the key. Oh no! See, that's that's right. That's right. I remember exactly what happened. I went to record this, and my computer did that stupid crashing bullshit again. And uh, I'm actually further behind than where I thought I was. So I need to be back in here. And I need to use the knife on the couch. Yes, seems like a f fantastic idea. I found a key. All right, I will take that key. Yes, I will. And uh, you may have noticed that I have totally skipped the right room here. So let's go in there and take care of this finally. I should have just come here the first thing. But no, I didn't. So let's take a look around here. We got a, uh, we got a star chart. It's kind of cool. Got a bookcase with books that I'm never going to read. No, no, let's just sit here and read books while our sister is in danger. That's, that's a great idea. Actually, you know, let's do that. Let's read this book right here. Oh, it's Magbook. I love Magbook. It's one of my favorites. Let's read Magbook. About magic in general. Magic is not good nor bad. If it is used good, or if it is used properly, good may result. And let me guess, if it's not used properly, bad things happen. Yeah, of course. What follows are a few magical spells. From nothing it shall form, and none shall see the cloud EC. Okay. I'm, um... Spoiler alert, I'm pretty sure that has literally no purpose in this game. Awake to sleep, movement to still, six legs or more, bend to your will. Stellini. Yeah, uh, take a guess here. What has more than six legs? I'll give you a hint. It's a spider. I'm gonna have to use that on a spider. That's my guess. Actually, once again, I don't think you really actually need to use that spell. And here's a spell you have to use, Thundini. With more than one, the storm to come to make them run. Yeah, Thundidi. It sounds like a Kirby's Dreamland bad guy. Sort of. Wasn't wasn't that guy's name King Dedede or something like that? I don't know my Nintendo characters very well. It was never really big into Kirby. From here there, uh, from here to there, when stone walls impair telemaze. For teleporting. All right. So nameless protagonist is now a wizard with super cool wizard powers. Good for him. Good for him. So, let's let's use some of these spells. Uh, where's my spellbook? Here's my spellbook. Let's let's use this spell because there's I'm pretty sure it has literally no purpose. So let's shout it. Let's cast some spells. You feel a tingling in the air when you chant the spell. A cloud suddenly appears around you, blotting out your surroundings. Almost as quickly as it came, it leaves, and it just turns the screen beige, tan. The spell took a lot out of you, so I just have to sit here. Do 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 do. All right, I guess I'm good now. <laughs> guess it didn't take that much out of me. All right, let's get the hell out of here. That's the only thing you gotta do in that room. Ah, but there's more. I'm missing something. Hmm. There's something else I have to do in here, but I'm missing an item. Maybe. Ah, oh, there wasn't anything in the. Hmm. Oh, let's go back upstairs. Let's let's go back into uh, Master Crowley's bedroom. As you can see, we still have that to open. So where's my key? Where is my key? Knife one. I need key. There's the key. We're gonna use key one on this thing. All right. We got ooh. We got a box. We got some scrolls. And we got a bottle. Click. The closet is unlocked. We're just gonna go ahead and. Yeah, what we got here? We got the box has been shrunk wrapped. Shrink wrapped. What's this? It seems to be generating heat inside. What? That's strange. Um, okay, what's the scroll? It 
It's a rolled up scroll sealed with wax. All right. I'm assuming this, this is the same thing. Yeah. A dark liquid sloshes inside the bottle. Hmm. That sounds wonderful. Is it whiskey? It's probably whiskey. Just says a dark liquid. Whiskey's kind of dark, isn't it? I mean, I'm totally going to drink that and nothing bad's going to happen. No, why would it? It's not poison or anything. Probably. Probably not. Uh, I'm actually kind of curious because I'm relatively positive you can kill yourself by drinking things in this game that you shouldn't be drinking. So I'm going to do like two-year-olds do in a house without proper, um, I don't know, what are those things called? Like child safety locks? Yeah, I'm going to start drinking things from cabinets like a dumbass. So let's save the game. Let's open up bottle two. And we're gonna use it on ourselves, and we're gonna hope for the best. Hopefully, this gives me superpowers. I, I'm, I'm really, I'm really holding out for some, some superpowers. Uh, uh oh, oh, that's not good. Oh, uh, the music changed. Ye oh, I become nauseous and disoriented. Oh no, oh, and I'm unconscious now. Never to awaken. Uh, oh god, and I'm dead. And that, kids. Why you never drink random liquids in unlabeled or unlabeled bottles? It's not a good idea. Don't do it. All right. Well, what's in here? I don't even think that's used for anything. Oh, wow, this, this is weird. Let's see. The decor of this room could be described as African Art Deco. Hmm, yes, I guess it could. I don't think there's anything I need in here either. It's a little. Indian man. Looks like a voodoo doll. We got some more towels. We've got another mask. Uh, we've got an orange liquid. And we've got something in a blue vial. Um, again, why is there no toilet in here? Does, does Master Crowley just not like toilets? Is he just like, students, well, I'm going to teach you magic, but you're never going to be able to poo comfortably. No, there's no, there's no toilets in here. I'm sorry that I have to result to, to bathroom humor, but seriously, what, why, are there, why is there not a single toilet in this entire house? It doesn't make any sense to me. Who designed this place? Oh man, it's probably the same guy who did Castle Wolfenstein. There's no toilets in there either. Jeez. Alright, well it's over here. Oh, this is just the closet, right? I don't, don't need to be in the closet. And this was the staircase? Oh no, I misclicked. Well, this is where I wanted to be anyways, so. Sparsely furnished, guest bedroom. What's in here? It has a ruby! Yeah, a ruby. Huh. It's a large blood red ruby. You feel some sort of strange power running through it. Hmm, hmm, maybe I should take that. Hmm, I'm not gonna take that. No, I'm not. I, I remember the ruby. I'm not I'm not falling for that trick again. No, I'm not. No, I am not. What does the ruby do? Who knows? Who knows? Play the game yourself. Pick up the ruby and have fun. It gives you superpowers, just like the dark liquid in that vial. Actually, speaking of vials, I picked up some other bottles. Oh yeah, see, I just saved and the game was a little glitchy there for a second. Let's see, we got some other bottles, so... <laughs> Um, I should do some of the scrolls. Let me open the scrolls. I'll drink the bottles later. Open scroll two. It reads gold, silver, and mercury. Together they form a key. All right, so that's a solution to the puzzle that goes with the card I picked up. All right. It's pretty, It's. I mean, it's pretty obvious that it's a, a combination to a, a safe or something. The scroll reads, the heart of the garden maze contains the Blothany gem. Okay. It is guarded by he who moves as the moon. O okay. If you say so. Um, and I think in tradition of this, how this series has been going, let's, let's try to brutally kill ourselves. Uh, so, I don't know, let's just start drinking things. Yeah, let's open this up. And what was this? This is the orange liquid, right? 
Uh, yeah, or, yeah, let's, let's, let's use this. That's a great idea. Use this on ourself. Oh, it's just cheap perfume. Okay. Alright, that's, that's pretty safe, I guess. What about bottle four? What does this do? I'd like to use this on myself. Um, alright, it's more cologne. Okay, just lots of cologne. Man, I've used so much cologne on myself, it's ridiculous. Alright, well, I, I guess I'm not... I guess I'm not dying from drinking strange liquids anymore. Alright, well, you know what? I think I'll just kind of leave it here, I guess. I've been doing this for 15 minutes, so... I'll just stop here, and next time we'll solve some more puzzles and make some more progress. I'm Wizarduous, thanks for watching, and I'll uh, see you guys later for some more Uninvited.